We'll guide you through how to fix WhatsApp not working on an iPhone. If you find this guide useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This can be super annoying. So make sure you watch the full video so you can try the different fixes, as of course there are different problems you may be facing. So let's get started. First of all, do just make sure you have a working internet connection on your phone. If you don't, that's why it's not working. So make sure you connect it to Wi-Fi or you've got cellular on mobile data. If that's the case, then let's get into the first fix. What you want to do is go and swipe up on it like so, just from the bottom bar and then fully swipe up on it to go and close it. Sometimes just going and closing it and opening it again will solve the problem. If it still isn't come out of it, open up your settings and scroll down and select general and then select iPhone storage. What you need to do is go and scroll down and go and click on show all and go and find WhatsApp. Go and click on it and then you can click on offload app. This will delete the app, but keep its documents and data. And so we can then go and reinstall it. Doing this can go and solve the problem. So click on reinstall app. When it's finished, it will then go and say offload app again, as you can see. We can then open up WhatsApp and go and see if the problem is solved. Hopefully it now is. If it still isn't, then what you want to try doing is performing a forced restart. To do that, press the increase volume button on your phone, the decrease volume button, and hold down the side power button. Keep on holding it down, you should see your phone screen go black and shortly you should see the Apple icon appear. At that point release and it should start again and then hopefully the problem will be solved. 